Hey, what's up guys? In this project, we're building a DIY fireplace. We made this look like the Grinch is hiding inside the chimney. But if you get too close, he'll actually go inside the chimney and comes back out when you step off of the hidden switch under the rug. An LED strip makes for cool lighting effects that makes this look like a warm and cozy fireplace. All of the electronics are hidden inside and controlled by an Adafruit Circuit Playground Express. You can get all of the parts to build this project. Links are in the description. We used Microsoft's MakeCode to program the Circuit Playground so we can easily drive the NeoPixel LEDs and control the servo. Everything is connected with alligator clips so you can just plug in the components and you don't need to solder anything. We built the fireplace out of cardboard boxes and poster boards so it's lightweight and easy to move around. The Grinch is a paper cutout that we made using a vinyl cutter. A servo arm is attached to a piece of cardboard to form a base for the Grinch cutout. This allows for the head to pivot once inside the fireplace. We designed and 3D printed some brackets to easily attach the components. Be sure to check out our full step-by-step -step tutorial by heading over to the Adafruit Learning System. Links are in the description. With the paper cutout attached to the servo, we can hot glue it inside the fireplace and position it so it fits. Just be sure to test out the motion so the paper cutout is able to pivot. We'll construct a switch from scraps of cardboard. Pieces of aluminum foil are used to create conductive pads. Use double stick tape to attach them to the cardboard. Strips of copper tape are used to connect alligator clips to the Circuit Playground Express. So when two pieces of cardboard touch, it'll trigger the servo. This makes for a DIY switch that you can step on and hide under a rug or floor mat. Paper tubes can be used to create the logs for the fireplace, and these can be painted with texture to make it look more realistic. Pro tip, cutting out holes allows for light to shine through, making this look a bit more like a burning fire. We think this is a fun project that can include the whole family and maybe even make its way into a holiday tradition. There's different levels of crafting going on here, so we hope you get creative and think of unique ideas that your family will enjoy. Thanks so much for watching and we hope you have an awesome maker holiday. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more DIY projects from Adafruit.